All right, great. All right, welcome everybody. We are the JP University. We are in mid-May and I am super excited to have Caprice do our call tonight. She has really been such a mentor and teacher to me around social media and she is always up on everything new, all the latest everything. And so tonight we're gonna hear a little bit about how AI chat can really help um, you create verbiage, and in fact, I had a little experience with Heidi the other day. We were wondering what a good title for, no, that was you, the title. We were ask, asking, well, how would you respond to this question that a customer asked? And the response was pretty darn good. We just had to change a few words and personalize it, but I was shocked at how good this AI business is. So I'm gonna turn this over to you, Caprice, and let's have fun. Yes, this is gonna be fun. I, the first time I learned about it, I was wowed. And now it's saving just a ton of time. So chat GPT is an AI artificial intelligence that's I've read is the number one. I think it was the original. Now there's all kinds of them uh, copies coming out, but this is supposed to be the most accurate. And so far in my experience, it is really, really good. As so some of you may wonder, what is GPT? And GPT stands for Generative Pre-Trained Transformer. So it's all this code that just has so many different versions and iterations and memory, and it, it basically is trained and you can actually train it to speak in your voice. So it's an AI powered chatbot. It's very simple to use and it, it's capable of creating interaction style human conversation. A little, sounds a little scary, but I don't see iRobot happening anytime soon. It's, it's really an aid for us in business and life that's just making things a lot easier and saving us a whole lot of time. Um, it does things like answer questions, writes marketing verbiage, emails, text, plans, eating plans, exercise plans, and even for really advanced use, it can even write computer code. I don't, I'm not there yet, but uh, it can do a lot and it's going to continue to advance. So why would you use ChatGPT? It's a significant time savings. And, you know, there are some people that, that say, oh, it's going to replace humans. And at least now I don't see it doing that. Now it's really an aid for us and it gives us ideas that we can build upon. And so there's a lot of really helpful things that it can do in your business and your life. So I wanted to share with you, uh, before I do, do some demos with you, I wanted to show uh, some of what I'm finding chat GPT useful for. And what I'm finding I'm using it most for is Juice Plus social media posts, creating that creative text. A lot of times we'll see, how many of you have sat there just wondering, you know, what, what should I post today? You know, how can I write it differently than I did yesterday? Um, what can I come up with creative about using lemons, you know, for health purposes, things like that. We've sit and ponder, and this really could just help us really quickly be creative in our marketing posts. Um, it re is really useful for uh, emailing and text texting verbiage. Um, you can actually write outlines for presentations, which, by the way, I forgot to ask it to write the outline for this presentation, but it would have if I asked it to create a presentation around how to use chat GPT. Uh, it's wonderful for write, asking it to write verbiage to help you attract certain target markets to Juice Plus. Or maybe you want to write it in, in a tone that um, millennials can relate to. So you can write something. I mean, that's always been a challenge for someone my age in my mid fifties that I'm not necessarily relatable or would know how a millennial will speak. Well, I can write something and then say, you know, will you please write this in millennial speak? And it'll rewrite the whole thing in seconds in the in the tone in the the with the vocabulary and and slant that a millennial would be attracted to you can come up with titles i've been using it a ton for titles for health talks and presentations you can have it write a bio on somebody you could just randy you could put in your um 
you know, just a few details about yourself to prompt it. And then it'll write a beautiful, a beautiful bio. You could ask it to do it in a um, humorous tone, or you can, you can ask it to write it in sophisticated language and you can ask it to regenerate in, um, you know, different, different ways. And it'll do that for you in seconds. Uh, you can look for synonyms uh, to change up your messaging for a particular audience. You can summarize articles that may maybe you want to start educating people about the importance of hydration or teach them about gluten. And so you're looking up articles online, but they're really long and you don't have time to read those. You can actually copy and paste it into chat GPT and chat G and you can say, please summarize the bullet point bullet points of this article and it'll just in seconds just give you the the meat so that's how yeah that's how it saves saves you so much time so i want to make sure here because i'm seeing i have this on speaker view but i'm seeing randy for some reason so i hope that it's are, are you all seeing well it depends on how you have it but on my end i'm seeing randy so i sure hope that it actually shows of uh, what I'm going to be um, showing on the screen. Um, so hold on here a second. Okay, get, let me get back to my notes. I lost it. Okay, so some of the other things that, that it, I'm using it for, I've experimented with are, uh, you know, you can write a form. Let's say you want to ask your Juice Plus customers some questions a couple weeks in. And you want to know, like, like phone conversation bullet points. Um, how can I, what questions could I ask my client when I call her about her Juice Plus experience? And it'll pop up, like, say, give me 10 questions that I can ask about their juice, their experience with concentrated plant powders and Juice Plus. And then you'll have your whole co phone conversation just outlined for you right there. I. Uh, some of the other things that, that it's wonderful for is finding relevant quotes that you can use to relate to health. So it may be, maybe um, uh, you're somebody that loves, you feel like, you know, it's a blessing to be able to eat healthy. And you can ask, provide me some quotes that talk about incorporate how blessed we are to have our health. And then it'll just boom, 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 boom. It'll list all these quotes that are perfect to match what you're thinking that you want to put out. Uh, and so it, it it can match your energy. And you know what happens? Chat GPT starts to memorize you and what you, how you like to speak, um, what, how, you know, you know, how, what types of messaging that you favor um, kind of, understands like your characteristics based on the things you ask and so ultimately it's it is going to mirror you know as if you, you're you're speaking and so you could even ask it to rewrite um, a text or an email that you've written before and rewrite it um, in a, um, a friendlier tone or you can say uh, memorize this this is the way I sound, the way I write, and it will learn. And that way you can just say, how should I respond to this text? And you can put in somebody's text and it'll give you a response in the way that you would answer. So it's-, so, it's Caprice, I have a quick question. Are, yeah. you see, are you seeing you now on your screen or are you still seeing- No, right? I see you. I see you. And okay. I, have it on, I have it on speaker. That's because I'm speaking. You want a spot in the future. You want to spotlight yourself. It doesn't interfere then with anything you're doing rather than speaker view. If you spotlight yourself. Well, but, even when I was talking though, I wasn't, I wasn't in the main screen. Well, cause Randy was making, there was some noise in the background. So she was popping up. So all I'm okay. saying is in the future. How do I do it? I don't know how to do that. So if you put your, your cursor on your picture, what should on pop up picture. is. Okay is spotlight me or speaker view. And if you, you should say spotlight me, and then then once you hit spotlight you, then you put it on speaker view, nobody else can get in to be speakers. Yeah, it must have something to do with this not being mine because it doesn't tell me, it doesn't give me that option. Okay. Oh, there is a pin though. Can I, I can pin me. Can I Probably, do that? Probably, yes, that, that okay. might work. Well, let me try that. Okay. Because we don't want me doing this presentation and then at the end, just having you sitting there watching. <laughs> right. Well, I'm going to put my on mute so you won't hear me anymore. Okay, so there I am. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you, Nikki. I was, I was concerned about that. So you fixed it. 
Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, give you a couple more examples, and then we're going to do a demo. So, so you can look up facts, you inspire, you know, I want inspiring ways to use lemons in creative ways to help health. Um, you can write books. I know people that are authors that are writing or they're, they're author coaches and they're helping people write books in like 90 minutes. Um, of course, you don't want to complete, you want to modify it and you want it to, you don't want to just plagiarize. I mean, there are, there are, um, you, you can actually ask it to reword so it's not plagiarized. So, um, so it's interesting. And you can ask it to translate into any language. So say you have a marketing message or a text that you want to send out and you have some Spanish speaking uh, friends that you want to share that message with and, and you can translate it to Spanish. So what do you think about all these creative ways to use chat GPTs? I mean, raise your hands if you think that sounds amazing. <laughs> it's, it's, it's quite incredible. So, you know, there's some things you can use it for in your own life or to, to aid in the coaching of your, your clients outside of just Juice Plus, but maybe you want, you're helping them adopt healthier lifestyle habits and, and you want to um, expand on, on the shred and you want to give them some more specifics related to their specific diet needs. So you can actually type in give me a meal plan that's high protein, low calorie, and doesn't include nightshades or, or, or gluten. And it'll give you a five, you know, you can say, give me a five day meal plan and then it'll, it'll spit that out. So you can ask them, I, I, I want to, you know, get some harder abs and some, some stronger glutes, you know, give me a workout for the week that will um, tighten my, my booty. It'll give it'll spit it all out. So, so it's, such a handy aid to have. Um, we also can, um, I talked to you about how you can train it to uh, actually learn your languaging too, which is really, really cool. You can also change the style. If you, were, if you write something and you want it to be in a more friendly tone or more sophisticated, like I said before, you can do that. Um, you can ask it to write a response. Oh, I, I told you about that as well. So I like it too, because it just allows you to become really creative. So I'm going to show you a demo where I, I want to teach people about drinking more water, but I want to make it funny because on social media, you want to, when you post on social media, you want to educate, you want to encourage, or you want to entertain. And so just remember the three E's. So it's always fun. Facebook will show your post to more people if it's really good in one of those areas. So if you want to be funny, you could type in, um, um, write a message uh, where Arnold Schwarzenegger is dehydrated in the desert and he's recommending everyone drink more water. And so some, I'm going to show you what comes up. We'll just experiment with that. But you can just be really, really creative, and that'll help your social media reach. Um, you can also save all of this in chat GPT. So like if all these different categories, you know, I'm bios, I'm, I'm doing um, health events, I'm doing workouts. You can save those. And if you want to go back into um, titles for health events, you could go back and just continue that, that chat thread and get more ideas and modify your prompts. And then they're saved. So before I go in the demo, I just want to share with you that, um, that chat GPT is free. And so far I've been having, you know, it's been fine free. So the main benefit of paying $20 a month right now is that you prioritize yourself in their system. So you know, there are millions and millions and millions of people getting on chat on, on AI right now. It, it was a faster growth than Instagram, any other platform. In five days, it had millions of users already. So, so you can imagine that during peak times, there's a lot of traffic. And so sometimes you have to sit there for a few seconds, which is too long for a lot of people to wait for the response. And so if you pay, then you get prioritized so that you don't have those lags. And so that's one of the key benefits of paying $20 a month, although I haven't needed it yet. And also um, they're going to start to provide um, um you know, new features and things like that to the people who are paid members first. So on May 25th, uh, how many of you know Fraser Brooks? 
Fraser Brooks is just a social media guru. If you don't follow him, follow him because you'll just learn a lot just by following his social media. But he is doing an AI training on May 25th. It's four hours. It's only, I think, $49. And I would recommend that you you join it. it you'll be able to get the recording if you can't watch it live um, because he is going to be, uh, you know, I think he's one of the best trainers. So you'll just go deeper on what I'm sharing with you today. So examples wise, let me share the screen. Um, I am going to show you what it looks like. So here is where you're going to go to sign up for, for chat GPT. So it's openai.com. Okay, so when you go to openai.com, you don't need this stuff. Let's go here. Oh, I guess I did need that. Okay, so openai.com slash blog slash chat GPT. And when you go in here, you're gonna set up your free account and, and then you'll have a you know username and passcode to get in. So I'm gonna go ahead and I, I have it open already here. So when I log in, when you log in, this is what you're gonna see. And you are gonna see that um, you can go down here to the bottom and this is it's as simple as just chatting with the chat bot. So I'm gonna share with you, I already um, pre-loaded some, some prompts. And then I'm going to ask you to also offer some ideas, but I'm going to start with one I did the other day and I'm going to plug it in the line here, write five intriguing titles to entice juice plus partners to attend a training about income and impact, how juice plus makes a difference. So you can see here that I have it plugged into the chat space and I'm going to return. So do you see how quickly it spit out the five titles? And I did use one of these titles for a training that we're, we're doing in Orange County. And if you want, you could I could ask it, uh, create, uh, make them shorter. Please, and it's nice to be polite. Please make them shorter. Okay, it remembers the question that you asked. Now it's just shortening those five titles that I created or that it created for me based on my prompt. They're, they're pretty good, aren't they? I mean, how long would have it taken, taken you to come up with some, you know, five different titles that were powerful? Um, now, I, if I wanted to, you know, say, make, make the language more powerful, um, include, uh, you know, the word healthy. I, I mean, I, I could just ask, ask it to, to add the word healthy. Um, so it's it's just really amazing. So I'm gonna go back to um, my, uh, I'm gonna do one more that I created and then I'm gonna ask one of you to, um, to go ahead and offer a prompt. So I have Stephen Shapiro coming out here to Orange County for the Orange County Co-op to do a home tour. In, at the end of June, you're all invited. And I wanted to uh, write a short summary for an event with Juice Plus Company Director, Partner and Customer Acquisition, Steve Shapiro, for a five-day Southern California tour designed to inspire partners and partner prospects with cutting edge information about the Juice Plus Company. Okay, so that's my prompt. And I'm gonna go ahead and ask it to, to write it. And as you can see, let me scroll down here. It's writing it. Do you see how elegant and how inspiring it is? And, and I mean, it talks about embark on a transformative journey as we bring you a five-day Southern California tour designed to inspire both our current partners and our partner prospects. And I mean, I would have sat there for an hour trying to come up, trying to wordsmith something like this. So now if I want to say, um, um, rewrite, I'm going to say, please rewrite with humor. 
Let's see what it says. Get ready to have your socks knocked off in our incredible event. Electrifying, more electrifying than a citrus powered rocket. <laughs> I mean, so you could just change it up. I mean, look at the bottom here. It says, unlock the secrets of success in a way that'll have you saying, Kale, yeah, sign me up. <laughs> I mean, I just love it because you could just make, have so much more fun, you know, than kind of the boring, you know, I've been doing this 18 years. Trust me, mine's boring. So it's really fun to go ahead and, and uh, just spice up, you know, your, your messaging. So with that, I'd love to ask somebody here uh, for a prompt. Who'd like to offer one? And if you wanna just raise your hand or just unmute yourself and ask. So just go ahead and unmute yourself and go for it. And I don't know where to find the pin, the unpin thing. Oh wait, there it is. Okay, so I'm gonna unpin so we can see everybody. Remove pin, okay. So who would like to offer a prompt? Caprice, this is yes. Tiff. I would love, love, love. We have uh, Dr. David Phillips coming to Reno next Wednesday, and I'm trying to come up with some kind of a text that I can send out to the people I haven't called yet. So is there some sort of like a text that we can have it? What, what, what is he going to be teaching on? What's, what's a, a few words about what he's teaching? Um, the apple or scalpel? I think it's called. Yes, okay. Apple or Scapel. Have you heard of that one? Yeah. Okay, so write a text to invite to Dr. Dave, David Phillips a uh, training called From Apple to Scalpel. Um, and is it one hour? And where is it? Reno, Nevada. And I would probably add in there the things that we knew, do know about David. Come listen to Iron Man or Kona Iron Man, Harvard Doc, teach us all how to get healthy. <laughs> Those are some things I would throw in. Um, just the things that you would think, Tiffany, you need to feed it something that it can go on and that's going to make right. it better. So you need to just do the natural stuff that we think is boring and what we would naturally say. Feed us some more information, Tiffany, that the... I, uh, AI can can convert for us. What else do you know about, what excites you about Dr. Phillips? Oh, great idea. So yes, I love that he's a triathlon. He's an ER doc, Harvard graduate. He um, He's funny, he's got a great sense of humor. He's, um, he said, okay, the title is Explore the Lifestyle Slash Disease Connection, Apple or Scalpel. Is that helpful? Okay, so I said write a text to invite the um, doctor, invite Dr. David Phillips. And invite would, to, it help, would it help Caprice to put in to invite prospects and existing customers? Sure, sure. I mean, um, the more information it would seem, I mean, these things that this AI just answered in the last two, you gave some really pertinent information that was actually worded quite well to begin with. So it just really converted the more information you get, the better specific it understands what you're looking for is what I can see. Yeah. So, right, so exactly. So write a text to invite people. I, I think people is fine. To Dr. David Phillips, one hour electrifying training called, you know, called from Apple to Scalpel. He's an Ironman, Harvard doctor teaching how to have optimal health, explore the lifestyle style, style disease connection. So here we go. And another thing I would add, I mean, you can add it later, I'd say that he really talks in terms that everybody can understand whether you're a professional or a mom, you're going to learn from this. So the normal yeah. stuff that we would be asking are, you know, the things that you already know, Tiffany, about him, you're going to bullet point all those things that you already know about him. Mm -hmm. So what did it say? Yeah. So this, it, it made him way too long of a text. So then I'll ask him to, I'm going to say, make it shorter. Uh, so, but you could see here how exciting it made it. Join us for a mind-blowing training session like no other. We're thrilled to present Dr. David Phillips, Iron Man, Harvard doctor, a true health superhero, as he unveils the secrets to achieving optimal health in his electrifying one-hour training session from Apple to Scalpel. Prepare to have you understand the lifestyle disease connection. 
turned upside down as Dr. Phillips dives deep into the core principles that can transform your well-being. With his wealth of knowledge and expertise, he will guide you through an eye-opening journey, revealing how our everyday choices impact our health outcomes, and so on and so forth. So since you want it to be a text, I will say, uh, please rewrite a shorter version to send via text. This is just amazing, I have to say. <laughs> Are you guys blown away? Mm -hmm. Okay, so look at here it wrote the text the version. Get ready for an electrifying training session with Dr. David Phillips. Join us for From Elfal to Scalpel, where this Iron Man and Harvard doctor will reveal the secrets to optimal health. Explore the lifestyle disease connection in just one hour. Don't miss out. Reserve your spot now. So that's how powerful this tool is and that i would go to that training tip <laughs> that sounds really right. exciting <laughs> yeah. of course i would go if it was boring a boring right. text too but <laughs> um okay so i'm going to go back to my um uh samples here and uh i want to put in another one that to show you what it could do um I'm going to see what it says for the one when I, I brought up uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh, gosh, let me let me stop this. What are you seeing right now? We're seeing the maximized juice plus impact with the last thing. Get ready for an electrifying training from Dr. David Phillips. OK, OK, good. Um, so I've got all these things on the screen here. I'm trying to move around. OK, I'm going to show you this here okay so i'm going to add pop in um ask okay write a response to an email um okay i'm gonna say write a message from arnold forchnegger um who is dehydrated in a desert and recommending everyone drink more water. Okay, so he's, I'm sure it's gotta say, I'll be back or something like that. <laughs> Maybe it's not writing it well in his, in his uh, accent. Rewrite in Arnold's accent. Okay. Okay. I need to revise my, my uh, prompt, but so it better understands that. But as you can see, it's a really fun message about drinking more water that, that, you know, it, it's, this would get great reach on social media because it's funny could, you could look up a, a GIF or something with Arnold Schwarzenegger on it, and um, and it will give you a way to teach and educate, you know, edutain people um, by having ChatGPT write something creative like this for you. Does anyone else have any other ideas? Anything else you'd like to uh, suggest? Yeah, I, I'd love to see how it might invite to the Healthy Living Affiliates call tomorrow night. Um where we're going to have speakers talk about um, what it means to be an affiliate, why plant powders are so important and how they can impact the world health and finances. And the presenters are great speakers and have amazing graphics. Attention all health enthusiasts and inspiring affiliates. Join us tomorrow night for an exclusive call on Healthy Living Affiliates featuring incredible speakers. Uh, let me scroll back up there. It's going too fast for me. But, you know, the thing is, is it'll write very thorough. You know, look, it even put in, you know, put, add your date time, RSVP link. Uh, see you soon, the Healthy Living Affiliates team.
Um, but I, you can always ask it, you know, write it in bullet point form, write it in one short paragraph, write it in text form. So it's always going to start with like the more thorough, comprehensive. I, 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 love ask it. I love the, but wait, there's more. Our speakers will bring these concepts to life with mind blowing graphics. So we'll educate and captivate you. So all I said was great graphics, right? Because they always impress me. But look at how they, um, you know, emphasized it and described it. It's amazing. Yeah. Okay. And I'll show you one more before I, um, I mean, we're kind of running up on a half, half an hour now. Um, but I wanted to show you one that I thought was really incredible that it answered, it responded with the other night. Um, and it is, sorry, let me get. Um, Hold on one moment, I'm getting my, my script here. Um, think of another, if anybody has any other ideas, think while I'm looking for this one and we'll do one more of one of your ideas. Um, oh gosh, that's a good one. Maybe we'll do a couple more. I'm going to show you something. This, this could be valuable for everyone. So I, I looked up on, I Googled, um, Gluten, you know, why is gluten harmful, you know, for some people's gut lining in, in, in a, a really, really long article came up, you know, but I, but I, I want to educate people a little bit more on, I always have people say, why, you know, why, why is it harmful um, or can it be harmful? And so I'm going to ask it to summarize this article because I'd like to be able to share, you know, the key points out of this article, but I don't want to read like five pages of an article. So I'm posting this long article here. You can see how long it is. I mean, it's super long. There's lot, lots of details. I just don't have time to read it all, but I want to get the key points out of it. So I asked it just to summarize the key points. And you know, I'm not going to read it word for word, but as you can see, it's just pulling out the key points of the article. And then I can choose the points. In fact, what I could do is I could decide to do a, a Facebook Live series where I every day I come into my social media and I I talk for just three minutes on a Facebook Live about one of these top one of these items, and I could do that for 13 days. And that will give me a whole lot more exposure as someone that people perceive as someone to come to uh, for health, for, for health coaching, health advice and nutrition uh, or shred 10. So um, does anybody else have another, but we'll do like a couple more before, before we close. I think we should only take one more because it's after six. So we've gone the 30 minutes, but it's so much fun, Caprice. I, this training is blowing my mind and I know it is everybody else's as well. Oh, here, well, okay. We've got to try this one because we're talking a lot about Juice Plus. But let's say um, give me a uh, five day and then we'll take one last, last one. Five day meal plan um, that excludes bananas, my, my son's on a, a, a cleanse and so and he, and he can't have um, bananas just for a certain reason and nightshades, um, nut butters, or grains. So give me a five-day meal plan that excludes bananas, nightshades, nut butters, or grains. Certainly, here's a five-day plan that excludes bananas, nightshades, nut butters, and grains. So you can see how easily you can customize a meal plan that that includes what you need and excludes what you don't. And, you know, I, I like this, but my son's really concerned about his protein and caloric intake. So he's concerned that healthy eating is too low calorie and, and not enough, not enough protein. And, and so I'm going to ask it, please rewrite um to include uh, calories and protein numbers. So certainly here it is revised with the calories and protein. So now I could just tell him, look, don't worry about it. You're gonna get you know, 3000 calories a day with this plan instead of him guessing and thinking that it's too healthy and it doesn't have enough calories. 
Or I can say, oh, it's only 2,500 calories. Let me ask, let me see what snacks you can add in to add that additional 500 calories you need a day. So, um, so that, with, with that, is there any other, you want to do somebody's one more? And then we can call I, it I think we I think we've got the picture, Caprice. Maybe okay. you can stop sharing. And if anybody has a question, again, just directly to you, if you want to pin yourself again. But that was amazing. I think we got it in terms of it can do everything and anything. Oh, my gosh. I think it would have been interesting, Caprice, to put in the shred guidelines. More water, no processed food, and see if, they're, if they came up with our shred uh, diet. That would be really fun to see. You know, I put, I put in... Um um write an attractive um, um, appeal to health coaches to incorporate uh, juice plus in their their service offerings their product right. and service offerings and it came up with a a amazing like email I've never seen anything written well as well as that to to reach that target market right. so yeah so there's any questions? Donna? How do you then get this information to your Facebook page or wherever you want it to go to a you note? You just simply copy the text and, and paste it wherever you want it. Oh, there's a way. Okay. Copy and paste. Copy just like copy, paste. copy and paste. Right. Anybody else? All right. It's incredible. Well, that you made it simple. You made it fun. Uh, that was really great, Caprice. Now we just never have to think again. I don't know what this is going to do to our brains, but that's a whole other side to it. So, um, but it's amazing. I love it. Yeah, and I, I think that it, it I, I had that re reaction in the beginning too, though it's helping to expand our thinking. Because I won't make this comment until you read the, the book, the uh the extra I think the, or that's like is that what it's called the every once you've read the book the every you could change your mind but let's forget that it's amazing <laughs> it's fabulous i can see how it works um i'm just thrilled with it i really am great well i'm here if anybody has any questions feel free to to send me a message on boxer and i'll do my best to help guide you all right well you can hit the stop recording caprice and figure out how to get it